Hello, this is going to be a review of my floppy cube that I got from efforts.com. Um, I'll put a link in the description box over here to the right. Um, I got this from efforts.com and I ordered it um, a few weeks ago and it, it took about a week and a half to ship. Um, almost two weeks. So the shipping was a little bit long, but that's that's regular for most shipments from China. I do have an unboxing video where I think I talk more about the shipping if you want to look up the unboxing video for this particular puzzle. Um, as for the puzzle itself, it's really, really stiff when you get it out of the box. And it's really hard to turn when you get it out of the box. It has a very strange mechanism about how it um, works, but um, I'll explain that in a minute. As for the solving of the puzzle, the puzzle solves really easily. It's, it's almost hard to scramble it because you're trying to scramble it and mix it up and it solves itself. So it's almost like you have to turn like only two or three sides and then consider that scrambled and then go ahead and solve it. Because other, if you try to scramble it, you're going to end up solving it on accident. Um, but it's an easy easy puzzle, very fun puzzle. It's, re it's really cool to give it to people who don't know how to solve 3 by 3s because a lot of people, if you solve a 3 by 3 in front of them, they're like, oh, that's cool, I wish I could do that. Hand them this. Because I bet you they can do this. Because this is probably the easiest puzzle out there. It's really simple. Most people get it on accident. Okay, as for the mechanism, the turning mechanism, um, it rotates on a little circular um, segment that connects like right between these two pieces. And it, and it rotates along that little thing. So this is not actually a centerpiece. It's, it's like a cap that goes over the mechanism on the inside of that piece. And when you rotate the, the piece, it actually bends a little bit. So you can see you can see it bending right there. And here you'll notice it even more when I turn up this piece. So you see how that, that center piece is like really bent right there. Um, I don't know if I like that. It kind of makes the puzzle flimsy. But I guess that's why they call it a floppy cube, right? <laughs> um, the puzzle costs about $16 if you buy it from efforts.com. And it comes with the void cube stickers and color orientation. So it has that weird light blue and the two sets of grays and the pastel Easter egg green color. And I didn't really like those, so I put a nice um, cube for you sticker finish on it. Um, also, in the box, it has blue on this side and green on this side. So it doesn't have yellow and white as the main colors well because it doesn't have yellow and white <laughs> on the normal stickers um, the cubes again is really stiff but if you lubricate it how you lubricate it is you turn this 45 or sorry not 45 degrees 90 degrees to where you can see this little arc right here let me see if you can see that on the camera there's actually a little opening right there where that gap is and you take your little um, straw from your lubricant can and you just stick it in there give it a spray it doesn't really work around the puzzle very well so you have to spray all four sides before it actually starts moving but after after that it'll become very flimsy and really easy for you to turn and stuff like that um, just lubricate it with some silicone other than that uh, I don't really know what else to say about the puzzle um, it's a fun fun puzzle I'd say it's a good buy. I mean, it's it's really easy. So if you're looking for something challenging, don't get this. But if you're kind of a collector, or you just like cool and little neat things like this, then go ahead and get it. It's a good puzzle. Um, so that is the floppy cube, the one by three by three puzzle. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to comment. I'll be glad to answer. Thank you for watching. Please rate and subscribe. See you later.